So, hello. Uh, my first question is, could you please introduce yourself and also the project you are presenting here at the Zero Project Conference? Well, hello. My name is Fernando Botelho, and I am working with F123, which is a project that seeks to make education and employment more easily accessible to the blind with low-cost, high-performance technologies. Um, what are the top three reasons this project is a success? F123 is really successful because we're not trying to reinvent the wheel. We are taking open source uh, software technologies, making them easy to install. We support them with technical assistance and we offer a training material and online distance learning courses to make it easy for the new user to be productive. Do you see um, any obstacles to implement this, this project on a global scale in other countries as well? The biggest obstacle we have right now is that because we are a project that focuses on a low-cost solution, we don't have very large marketing budgets. So it's essential for us to have opportunities such as the Zero Project Conference where we are able to show the work we do to a number of companies, governments, and foundations so that they become aware of what's available and the ways in which we can help them. That way we can keep our costs down and dramatically increase the scale of our social impact. And uh, talking about the Zero Project Conference, what is your impression and also what is your wish for the future? The Zero Project Conference has been wonderful. It's especially good because we have here a number of sectors being represented. Government, foundations, NGOs, and even uh, end users or persons with disabilities. So this variety is, is always very productive for us. Uh, in terms of wishes, it would be wonderful to have an opportunity such as this one uh, being organized uh, in a developing country. It will be wonderful because there are a lot of interesting projects and experts that can contribute quite a bit, but it is rather expensive for some of them to come all the way to Vienna, so it will be nice to alternate between a developing country uh, and a developed country year by year. Okay, thank you very much.